I want to start with our first question from Joanne, who asked, do false prophets know that they are false prophets? And it's an interesting question. Let me define a term or two here first. Uh, a false prophet, or we could say a false teacher, same thing, is not simply someone who teaches the Bible incorrectly. Someone who does a poor job of teaching, we would call them a bad teacher. Uh, we would call them an incompetent teacher or an unprepared teacher. Uh, not a false teacher or false prophet. The term in the Bible is very specific to someone who meets the qualifications that are given in a couple of places, Second Peter chapter 2 or Jude. And in both cases, what we find is a, a false teacher is someone who is, number one, an unbeliever. They are not a believer who is simply unprepared to teach properly, unskilled at teaching the Bible. No, th they are somebody who has no relationship with Jesus at all. And yet for personal gain, greedish, uh, greedy, selfish reasons, things they want to gain through influencing the church, they take on a persona of a teacher. And sometimes they're very successful at this. And so what do they know about their, themselves under those circumstances? Well, I would think it would be similar to the way most people see themselves before they come to faith. That is, they don't know what they're missing. So while they may recognize that they're taking advantage of people, they may recognize they have selfish desires in all of this, I doubt that they recognize that they are those that have been prophesied in the scriptures to be coming to deceive the church. They probably think that everybody does what they do. They probably just see themselves as one more of the same because from their point of view, it's all a game. It's all just an opportunity. Uh, they don't appreciate what it means to be in a relationship with the living God because they aren't. So I would say that false prophets don't understand the term. They don't understand what it means in the same way that we do. And even if they know they are trying to take advantage of people, they probably think that's what the whole Christianity game is about anyway. And unfortunately, in this day, that's often what it's about when you look at who's out there. So false prophets, false teachers are unbelievers who are involved in a charade of ministry because of selfish reasons. And for the most part, they are unaware of who they are in that respect. Mm -hmm.